bloody hell, we needed 120 minutes to decide that game. But we won! Last minute! Last minute! Artur goes down off overhead kick. I mean, it doesn't get much better than winning away from home in the cup. Last minute of extra time, overhead kick, spectacular finish. And to be fair, to be fair to Chiman on a difficult pitch, played really, really good football. Um, what I was most impressed with was even when it got late in the day, instead of sticking one up front, three forwards, constantly, constantly pressing and occupying all of their defenders, um, Chiman were in control for a lot of the game. Not to say that uh, Chiman just didn't have the odd chance or two. Um, Vyacheslav Grab made two spectacular saves, one in the very last minute of normal time. Um, but uh, Ragulkin really impressed me today. Uh, for me, it was a very close run thing for Man of the Match between him and Simon Fomin. Fomin was captain, he started in defence, um, in a three man defence, and then moved up into midfield in the second half, won everything, controlled the place. I think I've just about on balance have to give it to Fomin. But it's, it was very close. Um, and uh, I, the signs looked very promising. The, the running was there all day long. Um, there was slightly more sensible use of the ball than away to Ujanovsk. Um, and uh, we're through to the next round of the cup. I forget exactly who we're playing. It might be Nostra Novitroisk, but I might have got that wrong. Um, but either way, we're through to the next round. Now, we'll be back here in two weeks' time for the league. Now that we know what the pitch is like and we know what the players are like, I'm very confident. And not to forget as well that we'll see if Daniel Karpov and Yegor Glukov are back in the squad by then because they've been sent to train the youth team for the week or two. We'll see. Anyhow, really successful. Time to get on the team bus and I think I might be able to wangle a bit of a uh, pre-match meal with the team as well. Uh, and then it's a seven-hour journey back about 3 or 4 a.m. to Chimen. But I'm no stranger to that, am I? Thanks for joining me, guys. This has been Jude Abbins, and now we're going home. <laughs>